Hey guys, Thunder E here and welcome to our review of the Logitech G303 Daedalus Apex Pro Gaming Mouse. It was just announced in PAX East, it's available for just $69.99 and this is um, a really cool mouse uh, altogether from a Logitech. Now it's got a lot of features in there, so it's just designed for the enthusiast gamer, it's got advanced optical uh, sensors, the Delta Zero technology, so we'll, we'll find out more about that. It's also got, uh, it can light up into up to 16.8 million colors which of course is the new thing for every mouse nowadays. So taking a look at the mouse itself, it's got um, six programmable buttons. It's got metal spring button tensions for both keys. And it's also got some, it's got real nice, good tension on that scroll wheel. So it doesn't feel like it's moving too fast. You can also go through three onboard memory profiles. So you can actually change your DPI profiles, DPI from 200 to 12,000. These are the uh, two, two, two more buttons there that you can actually program on, on the mouse. And then you've got, can see that it lights up on the sides as well as in the logo on the top so you get a lot of um, you know customization in terms of lighting and things like that uh, for what you want to do with uh, of course the Logitech G303 um, optical gaming mouse now in terms of fit I've got larger hands of course as you guys know but um, you know this is something that uh, is really built for gamers with small hands but even I with larger hands is really easy to navigate and use feels comfortable I don't feel cramping I don't feel like it's difficult to hold it's something I can easily move now you see the cable it's got braided cables all the way down and while gaming with this um, mouse you can see the the ability to switch easily switch DPI really goes a long way I'm playing Dying Light right now I for some reason call this game Dying Light but but um, as you can see I'm, I'm you know shaking in this move my mouse on the screen quickly change my DPI I can change the intensity I can make it much faster slower and you know so on and so forth so um, it's an easy thing for a gamer to do especially on the fly you know when you're playing a game like you know Dying Light not daylight like I like calling it um you know where you're in intense action sequences you know zombies are chasing you things like that you want to be able to um, access uh, you know have quick access to menu options and things like that within your control setup that you can actually use with ease and um, that that goes a long way so I like it for that but the other aspect of um, this uh, mouse is also the Logitech uh, gaming software that allows you to do more customization to that so let's take a quick look at it which allows you to customize those 16.8 million colors and also toggle between our profiles so you can actually have your profile saved uh, onto the memory on um, the G303 you can toggle that over to automatic game detection whatever games you have playing right now or you could toggle it back and forth so you can see that there now um, if you go here you can actually set commands pertaining to games and right now it's picked up automatically uh, Arkham or Origins as well as uh, the online and single player you can add games in there that you have let's see if he has Dying Light since we'll be doing some of that does not no it doesn't have it but you can all go ahead and always add game profiles in there and you can see that comes up and you can select set commands all that fun stuff uh, in there <clears throat> you can also go ahead and change some of your point uh, DPI settings, especially for your presets. So these are what my science presets are, 400, 816, and 32. So you can actually change that, uh, the number of levels, make it 4, 5, or just 1, whatever you want to do. Assign shifts and uh, defaults. Um, also, you can tune um, whatever surface. So we're using the HyperX um pro gaming surface we can actually tune it here if we choose to and add a surface set it up and all that uh which is nice the other thing of course is also um you know you can assign uh, uh recording inputs to assign how you actually use um your your gaming keyboard mouse pad and stuff now to change the colors if we overhead head over here you can see the profile color settings you have three different profiles you can select from um, and, or create sorry your lighting zones of course are the logo and the sides and right now the only two effects for color cycle and breathing uh, so we can do a color cycle which is what we were doing earlier and uh, we can also do breathing for specific colors whether you want it on the sides 
logo with the sides things like that you can have a sleep timer to it and so on and so forth so you can actually do some of that stuff with it um, but that's what the software does so let's go ahead and round up this review the logitech g303 is an excellent gaming mouse uh, from logitech it's affordable at 69.99 six programmable buttons 16.8 million colors i can go on and on in terms of just reading the list but it does a very good job of what it is supposed to do play well as a gaming mouse so i definitely recommend it and i will have a link for you guys below if you want to definitely pick it up otherwise guys thank you very much uh don't forget to subscribe to the channel and leave your comments down below if you have any and this is thunder e saying thank you and always enjoy your entertainment Hey guys, Thunder E here, and welcome to our review of the Logitech G303 Daedalus Apex Pro Gaming Mouse. It was just announced in PAX East, it's available for just $69.99, and this is um, a really cool mouse uh, altogether from a Logitech. Now, it's got a lot of features in there. So it's just designed for the enthusiast gamer. It's got advanced optical uh, sensors, the Delta Zero technology. So we'll, we'll find out more about that. It's also got uh, 